welcome to my channel today I'm going to make a recipe that I grew up eating it's called bud bud and it and, and I need banana leaves to make it so follow me I'm gonna get some banana leaves from my side yard <laughs> okay Banana leaves. Wow! I need this for my recipe. It's a, it's a snack. Cassava, made out of cassava. Let me get a couple more. Don't fall. No. Do not fall. Right, Leanne? Mm-hmm. Oh, don't get hit. <laughs> no. This is a good leaves for banana bud bud. Okay, so I'll, I'll I'll show you later what I'm gonna do with this. Bye bye. Okay, guys. So the next step that I have to do is. I have cassava, yuca, they call it yuca, cassava. Um, let's see. I got this. At the, I bought it at the store. It was on sale, so I, I bought a whole bunch. It was frozen, so I saved a little bit of money in that one. But what I'm gonna do with the cassava or yuca is I'm gonna grind grind them. Okay, so I'm going to grind them. Let's see. Let's see this. So I don't put that much because... Oh! Might have to plug it in. Plug it in! There we go. You're gonna ground, you're gonna ground it like really, really, really fine. Okay, so I'm gonna keep going with that one. So now I got the one that's really, really fine. I'm gonna put them in here. Okay. You need to squeeze the juice out of this. It's better when it's really, really dry. So put them in here. So anyway, I'll finish the rest of this. Okay. Okay, guys. So I got all my cassava in here. Brown cassava, yuca. So my intention is really squeeze this out. Okay. See? Cassava's got water in it. See? So it has to be squeeze. Squeeze that it will be dried up. So 
back in the Philippines, I used to, we used to do this, but in, in a really hard way. We have to manually grade the, grade the cassava one by one. But here, I just use the machine. And then it's done. Just use the machine. So, so this is basically um, the same. See that? <laughs> Squeeze it out. I used the cloth, like a really skinny cloth. See it? And it squeezed all the juices out. So anyway, while I'm doing this, I'll be back, okay? Okay, so this is what I got. And I'm gonna, it's dry as much as I can. That was the best thing I could do with the drying. So, it's my cassava, brown cassava, yucca. Okay. All right. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now, you see? I'm gonna put um, coconut milk in here. Probably, let's see, yeah. Just coconut milk. Okay, well, I'm only gonna put one of this coconut milk in here, here, in here. And then I'm going to add probably, I'm going to say, two cups of sugar. Okay? So hang on. <laughs> okay. Something happened. So I got a one cup here. I mean, not one cup. The whole thing. whole thing goes in here. Okay, you see? Okay. All right. And I'll put in two cups of sugar. Okay, so two cups of sugar, that should be good, and we just mix this, mix it really good, you know what, I'm using my hands, my hands, my hands are clean. Here. I grew up eating this from the Philippines, but the way I do it here is easier. Back in the Philippines, we used to do everything manually, everything, the milk, I mean the coconut, the cassava, you gotta do it manually. It would take me, it would take us at least the whole day to make this stuff. But for me, a couple hours, as long as I have all the ingredients, it's done. Okay, so I'll keep mixing. Okay, so my next step is, see the leaves that I got from earlier, I gotta cut them, cut them enough to roll, okay, so, cut some leaves, oops, okay, so I'll keep doing this. 
Cut some leaves. I got some really good leaves right now, so that's why I'm making this recipe. Okay, so I'll keep doing this. Okay, so I got the leaves ready. I need the leaves to be cooked just a little bit. So I'm going to soak it in a boiling water. See? You literally just soak it in the side for a couple seconds. And then go on the other side. Oh, it's hot. Be careful. Couple seconds. I'm gonna use a clip so it doesn't so I won't get burned. So you go like that and that's it. That's the leaves. Okay? So you have to do that process otherwise the leaves are not are gonna break. Okay. Okay guys, next step. I got my leaves, which is blanche. I got my mix right here, cassava mix. And what I decided is I'm gonna put something in inside of it, which is this one. This is uh, grated, grated coconut with a little bit of sugar. Okay, so fresh, fresh coconut grated with a little bit of sugar. Okay, so this is basically a lot sweeter, a lot sweeter than this one. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how. Okay, I'm gonna show you how I'm going to roll it. Okay, see, I make a couple so you guys can see what I'm doing. A little bit of this. Okay. So now, roll, 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 see? And that's what it's going to look like, okay? So I'll just keep rolling, see? Okay, then squeeze it, see, squeeze, not too hard, but firm, squeeze, there you go, okay, now I'm going to put it right there, okay, so I'm going to make a couple more, just dry my leaves more and then you can make a lot big batch out of this and just put them in the freezer it's a very good very good snack okay and then that there you go okay and once again, squeeze it, roll, you want to, okay, okay, it's a work, it's a lot of process to do, but if you're used to it and making it all the time, it's really fast, so, Okay, squeeze, okay, fold, and fold, there you go, okay, and then when you put them down, it has to be fold down, like that, okay, okay, so I'll keep going and do this in a little bit, I'll let you know what's next. Okay guys, look, I got it done, all wrapped, ready to be steam, okay? So I'm going to be steaming these for at least, I would say 20 minutes, hi, 20, 20 minutes steam, okay? There you go, this is, turn it on, high heat, 
for 20 minutes. Stay tuned. Stay tuned for the finished product. You see? So, stay tuned. Okay, guys. I'm going to check. Here it is. That is ready, I think. I'm gonna get one. I'm gonna take one. Okay. Taking one. Ooh. Okay, so I got one. So what it looks like. See what it looks like. Let's see what well, this is what we call budbud cassava budbud. Oh, that looks so good. 